So this here is just an example of our draft board. As you can see, it's a very, very poor draft this year. <laughs> uh, Sid Hartman's our number one player on the board this year, so we're going to have to do something manipulating. What we've used in the past uh, at Winter Park is magnets. And this is what I've used my entire life. So yesterday was the first day I got a little bit of a tutorial on how to use this thing. So, but I'm getting used to it, so we're going to try, and this will be my second day trying to use this thing. But when we go through our graph, what I would do is we go through each position and we change grades or we listen to the coaches. Everything was handwritten, and then it was all put on boards like this, sideboards over here, and then uh, the people who are running the computers would go ahead and change the grades. Now, let me show you how this works. So, for example, when we're in a draft and we're, we're talking about, let's say, stacking halfbacks, okay, when we work the draft, we do it vertically like this, and then you have to mesh it all together. So, if I go ahead and tap David, I tap Frank Peters and Mark Rosen, okay, see how their names appear over here? So now, when we're sitting there getting ready to staff, well, who's the best halfback versus the best running back versus the best tight end? Now we can work off this board vertically to mesh everything together. So there are things, and Paul, give me a correction if I ask you. So if I want to move Mark Rosen ahead of McCoy. Here on my Here on my he goes all of a sudden all the way up to the top. So as we go through, you can see uh, we can manipulate it, and then when I click off of it, okay, it automatically goes back and gets corrected on this board. So it's all done uh, just by me not breaking any screens but touching it. But they'll make the adjustments on the grade, and then it automatically adjusts over here. So this is be an example of our front board, and then we're going to have 700 names on our back board. So as we get done this section up here, I can take this off, move the purple section up, and then the next section will come right underneath. So it's pretty uh, it's impressive on how we're going to be able to do some things. When we're in a draft meeting also, if we're talking about uh, Josh slash Mark Rosen, <laughs> on the sides, okay, the video will be playing on that player. We'll be seeing his workout, we'll be watching his combine, be watching his, what we call his uh, cut-up tape. So as we're sitting there discussing the player, on both sides would be uh, the video going and watching uh, watching his cut-up profile tape and his workout while we're sitting there discussing the player. So again, this is just another thing on our ownership and what they're doing to go beyond to make sure that there is not, I don't believe there's some electronic boards that are out there in some draft rooms but I think this is the first of this size and the ability to do what we're going to be able to do just by touching the screen.